B minor. This chord along with the F major seem to give people a lot of problems. I'm going to show you two ways to build the B minor chord, the barred way, and then I'm going to show you how to do it the open way, which a lot of people don't seem to know about. So here we go. We're going to start with the barred shape. So hopefully you watched the video before this, which was my A minor tutorial. And I'd mentioned that that chord shape is actually going to help us with our B minor shape. So go ahead and make your A minor chord right here. So we're just gonna kind of shift things around a little bit from here. So we have our A minor with our first three fingers. Now instead, let's just swap things around and use our last three to build A minor. So we still have A minor. Now just take this shape and move it up two frets. Now from here, this is what gives people a lot of trouble when this index finger comes into play, we're gonna bar over the first five strings. So basically I'm just using the side of my index finger here. Notice how it's curve shaped. It's not like flat and straight on here. You don't wanna use the front part of your finger cause it's just way too soft. You want to use more so the side here because you can feel more of like the bone in your finger and that side is just, it's a lot more durable when it comes to playing bar chords and you're more so easily going to build up your calluses there. So now to play the B minor, we're going to strum down from the fifth string. So all together, it should sound like this. All right. So for those of you that need a little bit of a break from the bar shape, here's our open shape. So it's exactly the same as our barred shape, except instead of barring over the first five strings, we're just gonna take our index finger and move it down to the first string. And we're gonna go ahead and strum down from the fourth string instead. So it'll sound like this. So there's definitely a difference in voicing between the barred and open shape. The barred shape is a lot more fuller and then the open shape is kind of lighter and brighter. There isn't anything wrong with playing the open shape. It doesn't make you a weaker guitarist or anything like that. So don't like put that in your head that just because you can't play the barred shape right away or if you just even don't want to just because you don't like the way it sounds. That's okay, because honestly the open shape is very pretty. I prefer the barred shape because I like that more fuller sound, but play whichever one that you prefer, but definitely try to work on the barred shape because it is really, really cool. And once you start getting those barred shapes down, they are so much fun because the transitions are super simple and I feel like it just makes playing guitar just that much more fun. So that is how you play the B minor chord. Our next chord up is the C minor. So make sure to practice this B minor shape because it's actually, gonna help us with our C minor chords. So keep those guitars tuned up and I will see you there.